Several people have been involved in the Johnny Depp and Amber Heard court case taking place right now, and there is one name grabbing everyone's attention. Elon Musk. There are several shocking revelations coming out of Amber Heard and Musk's relationship. So what was their relationship like, and what shocking revelations are we talking about? Stay tuned and watch! Elon Musk recently became a topic of discussion during the Amber Johnny Depp trial and one tweet grabbed our attention. The tweet read, Elon Musk really bought Twitter for $44 billion only to see the trending tweets that Amber Heard just used him as a filler, never loved him, and the time they were together, she craved for Johnny Depp all the time. Now, for those who don't know, Elon Musk and Amber Heard were a thing at one time. The two met back in 2013 on the sets of Machete Kills and became quick friends. Soon, they sparked dating rumors, but sources close to Elon insisted that the two weren't seeing each other until May 2016. And even then, they weren't serious until much later. Amber made their relationship official by sharing a photo of them together having dinner in April 2017. A source claimed that Musk pursued Amber and she was playing hard to get for a while before he got even more interested. According to the source, Musk was attracted to Heard's edginess. A separate source claimed that Heard wasn't easily intimidated and that she was focused and loved to learn. Their relationship, however, was short-lived and it came to an end a few months later. Elon actually confirmed these speculations a while later, saying, by the way, just to clear up some of the press storms this weekend, although Amber and I did break up, we are still friends, remain close, and love one another. He also added the reason for their breakup was their work schedules, preventing them from spending more time together. Elon also opened up about how the breakup affected him, saying, I just broke up with my girlfriend. I was really in love and it hurt bad. Well, she broke up with me more than I broke up with her. I think I've been in severe emotional pain for the last few weeks. Severe. For most of that day, I was morbid. And then I had to psych myself up, drink a couple of Red Bulls, hang out with positive people, and then, like, tell myself, I have all these people depending on me. All right, do it. Amber Heard also opened up about the breakup, saying, Being in the public eye means having to explain yourself to so many people so much of the time. In this case, I'd like to remain more quiet. Although we have broken up, Elon and I care deeply for one another and remain close. Thank you for the continued support, respect, and privacy during these difficult, very human times. Many may not know this, but the two gave their relationship another shot by the end of 2017 and even spent the holiday season together visiting Easter Island. However, in February 2018, Elon and Amber split for good, and according to a source, it was Musk who decided to end things with her agreeing to this decision. They, however, still cared about each other and that's what mattered to Elon. Now Musk's name has been dragged into depths and Hurt's case. First, Johnny Depp claims Amber Heard had an affair with Elon no later than one month after they tied the knot in 2015. He also said that Amber received late-night visits from Elon at the LA penthouse they shared when he was out of the country. Depp went on to claim Musk was even granted access to his home. The same mind Heard presented her battered face to the public. There were also reports that Musk had the threesome with Heard and Cara Delevingne at Depp's apartment in 2016 when Depp was out filming a movie scene in Australia. Elon Musk also shared some details about his relationship with Heard in 2020 amid reports of his act with Heard and Kara. He said, Kara and I are friends, but we've never been intimate. She would confirm this also. I wish to confirm again that Amber and I only started going out about a month after her divorce filing. I don't think I was ever even in the vicinity of Amber during their marriage. At the time, he also weighed in on the court case, stating that he would recommend that everyone involved bury the hatchet and move on, because life is too short for such extended negativity. Musk's relationship with Amber Heard was discussed in court in April 2022, when it was claimed that Musk had donated money to the American Civil Liberties Union on Amber's behalf. ACLU COO testified in a pre-recorded deposition that Elon Musk likely made a $500,000 donation in Amber's name. In addition, another $350,000 payment was made in 2018 from a Fidelity account that Depp's lawyers suggested came from Elon. It looks like Hurt manipulated Musk to make those donations. 
been there are also unsettling text messages that were recently read in court, stating that Amber was merely manipulating Elon. Depp's former talent agent Christian Carino shared details of 2018 messages in the courthouse and testified that Amber was dating Elon while trying to reconcile with Depp. In the text, Amber shared that she was sad while going through a breakup and that hated when things went public. Christian didn't mention Elon in the text, saying, You told me a thousand times you were just filling space. You weren't in love with him. I'm saying, why would you be sad if you weren't in love with him to begin with? Amber's text to Christian state that she missed up and also said this, I hate it that yet again a man lets me fall on the spikes by myself. Christian also testified that he never saw any marks on Amber and added that the allegations against Depp had a negative impact on his career. With all the evidence and the text messages, it's clear that Hurt was only manipulating and using Elon when they were together. And do you know he reacted to this? Well, Musk was supposed to be a witness for Amber Hurt, but now after all this, it turns out he will not be testifying. But what are your thoughts on this? Do let us know in the comments down below. Thanks for watching.